The number of families assigned to subsidy in January-February of this year, 1.7 times higher than in the same months of last year, reported the state statistics service. However, in general, in February 2019 subsidies for housing and communal services received 3,736,000 families, a quarter of the total number of households in Ukraine. In February 2018, the subsidies received 45% of Ukrainian households. The average size of public subsidies in February this year amounted to war. For the first two months of the year the total amount of accrued subsidies amounted to almost what 12.5 bean. The total amount allocated in this year's budget for the payment of municipal subsidies is 55 billion wa, however, not so clear. For the first two months of the year for subsidies applied 465,000 families. It is more than 17% more than the same time in 2018. At the same time for the same time significantly increased in debts to pay for communal. According to the state statistics service, in January, Ukrainians have consumed public services by 21 billion WA and paid only WA 15 billion, about 70%. The level of payment for heating and hot water is even worse, the Ukrainian average, only 61.5%. At the same time, debt on payments for utility services, excluding electricity, only for January increased by 7 billion WA, to WA 62 billion, of which half is debt for gas. In October 2018, the government decided to raise the price of gas for the population by almost a quarter, which resulted in an increase in tariffs for heating and hot water. The increase in gas prices allowed to negotiate with the IMF about the beginning of the new program of crediting of Ukraine. The establishment of a single market gas prices for all consumers, in particular, for the population, is a long-standing condition of cooperation with the IMF. However, in October the increase in prices for gas for the population not raised them to the market. So between Kiev and the IMF, there is agreement on the next two increases in May, in December of this year. Recently, Naftagaz, and subsequently Prime Minister and President stated that the current situation in the world markets, where prices have gone down, let's not raise the price of gas. In the case that the elections will be held in two rounds, their completion will coincide with the time when the IMF experts will check the implementation of Kiev promises that he took upon himself at the end of last year, having received the first tranche of a new standby program. Therefore, approval of the proposal on the immutability of gas prices remains for about a month. However, the current and the following years are a peak in terms of debt payments. In accordance with the schedule of these payments published by the bank in 2019, the government, central bank, companies and banks have to pay billion. Of these, about $6 billion on the national debt have to pay the government and the EMBU in the budget on repayment of debts allocated to more than $417 billion. This is the largest expenditure item in the budget.